All right, so this is going to be a Costco sale item review of these Cheetos. Normally six forty nine, um, it was a dollar sixty off. So five, what's that? Five, four ninety, about there. All right. So yeah. Anyways, um, I reviewed one of these earlier, but this is this is a puff version. So. I was actually looking for the sale item before because the other one was two bucks. So that was super cheap compared to this. It is so much more expensive. But the puffs are like a bigger bag. I don't know if it's, I didn't check, I don't remember what the weight of the other one was. But 21.3 ounces. Okay. We're going to give them a try. Basically says all the same stuff. Um, pure deliciousness, simply Cheetos puffs. The only difference is it says puffs, all right? White cheddar made with uh, real cheese, no artificial flavors, or no flavor, no artificial flavors or colors, excuse me. Enlarged to show texture. Cheese flavor snacks, here we go. Maybe this is the one my brother tried that he said he didn't like because I got the actual Cheetos before. I only saw one bag of this in my Costco. It was thrown on top of like some other bags of chips. So, yeah, I don't know. Maybe they're not selling this anymore. Here you go, delicious, deliciousness guaranteed. Or this snack is on us. So, if I don't like it, I can probably call them and they'll refund me or send me a coupon or something. I don't know. But, uh, yeah. Alright, please provide product name, bag size, date, price, and numbers found below. Price for each package. Um, okay, so this is what they mean. Wow, this is normally eight fifty one if you get it at a other store. So I think this is the numbers they're asking for at the bottom if you don't like them. Guaranteed fresh until the printed date. All right. So here you go. Nutrition facts. So you got nothing to lose except time if you have to call and ask for a refund if you don't like them. But here you go. Of course, Costco will also take it back, so you don't really have to call Fritos Company. Is it Fritos? Wait, who makes this again? Email. Yeah, Frito-Lay. Okay. So here you go. You can read through the nutrition facts yourself. 21 servings in a container or bag. All right. Contains milk, so if you're lactose intolerant, keep that in mind. Corn. Sorry, the light's kind of making this hard to see. All right, you can read through all that yourself. All right? I don't know what GF. Just kidding. Gluten-free. This time they actually wrote gluten-free on the packaging. Before, they just put a GF like that. And I was like, girlfriend, what is what was that? All right, smart label. You got the UPC code. You got these little colorful dots, whatever that means. Okay. Pure deliciousness, simply. Okay, so this says all the same stuff that the other bag said, pretty much. Oh, here you go. So that's what I saw before. I don't know why they have to say gluten-free all over the bag, as if um, people aren't going to see it on here. And for some reason, you need to see it over here. But uh, this one doesn't really tell you gluten-free. This looks like my girlfriend is wheat or something. <laughs> but uh, here you go. No, artif no artificial flavors or colors. Right, of course, the bag is probably artificially colored. Let's go ahead and open it. Okay, these are much more yellow looking. The puffs, let's see what they taste like. Hmm, basically, tastes the same as the other one, but puffy. If you know what puffy Cheetos taste like. Basically that. These puffs are a lot smaller though. Um, these are about the size of regular Cheetos, but puffy all the way through. So they're like an even shape and texture. But um, yeah, these aren't as giant puffy like the regular Cheetos puffs. So if that matters to you, I don't know why it would. Yeah. But um, to be honest, I prefer the regular Cheetos version of this. Uh, the puff ones, they're still okay. Same flavor. Um, I don't know why they cost so much more. Maybe they actually give you more. I didn't really check the weight of the other bag. 
But, um, I like them. Right? It's like a lighter cheese version of Cheetos. So, if the cheese is too strong for you, you can go ahead and give these a shot. And you might like them. Hopefully this video helped you guys. If it did, like, subscribe, give them a try. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.